Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Monica. If you're new here today, I figured I would start a little vlog and then I'm also going to be showing you a little tour of my Ikea packs wardrobe closet room system. If you want to stick around, make sure you subscribe to my channel. I make all kinds of lifestyle videos. Let's get into the day. One thing I'm trying to do is to get more sun, especially in the morning. So in the morning, I'll just come out here and get some sun for like 15 minutes. Come here, Rusty. Okay, I'm a freak about keeping my house clean, but my closet is the one room you might find. A mess in it's usually not that bad but my cargos are a little bit loose around the waist i bought these little buttons that you can attach to your pants and so i used the gold one and i just put it right next to the button that's already there and then let me close it and then it literally looks like it's supposed to be there. It came in so handy because I just got these, but for some reason, after you put them on, they kind of get a little loose. So glad I had these. Today, I took off work because we are going to International Mall to do a little shopping for an early Mother's Day present. So I just got dressed, made coffee, and I'm on my way to my mom's house. So funny story, if you follow me on TikTok, I made this video about a bag that I bought. It was a Marc Jacobs tote, um, the canvas one in the mini size. Basically, I bought it. It had a stain on it, so I took it back, returned it for a new one, brought it home, and then my husband said, oh, that looks like the free gift you get when you buy a cologne. Like, he thought it was a free gift. Let me show you the bag. I'm parched now, but this is the tote, and I honestly didn't know if I loved it or if I hated it when I bought it, but I thought it could be useful for like casual, you know, summer days, you know, running errands or whatever. Like I even drive anywhere, but. <laughs> so I made a TikTok like saying what he said and whatever, I just threw it up. Didn't think anybody was gonna watch it and it ended up getting over like 200,000 views. So random and like so many people were commenting on it. And I think probably like more than half were saying that they hated it and it was ugly. And then probably like 25% of people were like, oh, I like it, I have it in leather or I have it in this other fabric and I love it. So honestly, it's been sitting in my room for like three weeks now and I don't know if I'm going to keep it or return it. So we'll see. Okay, before Taylor said something, did you like it? <laughs> I didn't know if I loved it or if I hated it. Then take it back. <laughs> Guys, I returned the bag. Hi, Rissy. Hi, Rissy. I just got home from the mall. It was so ridiculously hot and humid outside and I'm wearing cargos, dunks, and my long sleeve skims cotton jersey. Oh my God. I cannot wait to take a shower and lay down. Okay, so I returned the purse, the tote, but I did get a little purse at Aldo. It's this little gold bag. It's so cute. It's cute. It's this right here. And it has a gold strap. I love it so much, I can't wait to wear it. Okay, I'm gonna go take a shower because I feel disgusting. Okay, so I'm gonna show you everything in my room, but let's start with the Ikea wardrobe system. I haven't finished decorating it or organizing it at all, so if you guys have any ideas on how to make it look better or any cute decoration ideas, please do let me know. Also, please don't mind the mismatched hangers. I still have to order more of the gold. These white and gold velvet hangers I got from Amazon. They are linked in my storefront. I love them, especially for pants. For shirts, they might be a little bit too big, but you can always fold the shirts and to the hanger if it's too big. So for the frames, you can get a small, medium, or large. I have a small and then two larges. There's two options for the depth of the frames. One is around 13 inches and one is around 22 inches and I picked the deeper option. So as you can see, you can fit like two to three rows of shoes. And there's also two options for the height. One is around 79 inches and one is around 92 inches. And I have the higher option. So starting 
with the small frame, I did only shelves on this one. And I just did some purses on the top two shelves. And then in the middle two shelves, I have mostly sneakers. And then on the bottom two shelves, I have some heels that I rarely wear. <laughs> For the middle frame, I did a shelf and then two clothing rods. So on the top shelf, I put some boots that I don't wear that often. And then I have my shirts here. And then on the bottom rod, I have my pants. For the third frame, I did a shelf, a clothing rod, and then four drawers on the bottom. So on the top shelf, I just have some decoration and my Giacomo's purse that I love, but it's so small, so I can barely wear it. And then I have a clothing rod where I did my tank tops, dresses, and then some sweaters and jackets. Those are my wedding shoes. And then I have this tray here with some everyday bags and some hair clips. Okay, so in this first drawer, I have some tank tops and these drawers are pretty big. They can hold a lot and they're soft clothes. And then the second drawer, I have my shorts. Then in the third drawer, I have just some t-shirts to be around in. And then in this fourth drawer, I have my workout clothes. It's basically a Nike drawer. <laughs> Over here, I have the Ikea Alex drawer, and then I have this jewelry stand, a jewelry box, and this fake plant right here. I have this lamp that I got from Target, and then I have this little shoe rack from Target as well. This shelf is from Ikea as well, and I just put some decoration on it. And then this bench is one of my favorite finds. This is from Home Goods. I was looking for something with gold on it, so I was so happy to find this one. And it also doubles as storage inside. I I love how big this mirror is. It's from Home Depot. The only thing I don't like about it is that the gold is a little bit too orangey for me, but it's honestly so heavy and big that I was like, there's no way I'm taking this back. <laughs> also, I just have my makeup right here because I usually do my makeup on the floor, so I just moved it over here. <laughs> I also have my work desk in here. I did have the matching white Ikea desk with the two Alex drawers in the top, but it just came out way too far. It was way too big, so. I took it apart. <laughs> so this rug, I was so pleasantly surprised by this rug. It is so soft. My dogs love to lay on it and it was like less than 50 bucks on Amazon. The last thing is just my ring light here in the corner. So when you go on the Ikea website, there's something called a PAX planner and it takes you to like a 3D room where you can put all of the frames and kind of like build it how you want it to look. You can select the insides of the frame. So like drawers, shelving and everything like that. And then you can put doors and handles. So yeah, it's so customizable. I don't know that this was like the best choice for a closet system, but it was like the only one that I kind of knew about. So I figured I would just go with it. And the only other thing is that you have to anchor it to the walls because you're filling the furniture with so much stuff and so much weight and you wanna make sure that it doesn't fall forward. So it's really highly recommended that you anchor it to the wall. Looking back, I kind of wish that I maybe did the configuration a little bit differently and took advantage more of this wall right here with the bench because I could use a little bit more space, but since it's already anchored to the wall, I really don't have a lot of choice. But anyways, I love how it is now and it's so useful. I love this room and I love like organizing it. It was fairly easy to put together, but for the medium and the larger size, they're pretty heavy. So you definitely need to have like someone else to help you. The smaller size I actually put together by myself. I will link the rug and the hangers on my Amazon storefront in case anyone wants to check them out. And then anything else from here that I can remember, I will link as well. Okay, this is so random, but the tote TikTok has 429,000 views. And then my TikTok of me returning it has 74,000. And I'm just like, the most random things can get the most views sometimes, like this random day when I posted about my implants, <laughs> which basically started my whole TikTok. It's crazy. I used to know if anyone else plays Zelda because the new season of Zelda came out and like me and my husband were so so excited for it we have been waiting for it for like months and we've been glued to it so i think we're just gonna like spend the next 12 hours just playing zelda 